Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. My name is WolfWorld63, and today we will be taking a look at um, a ship in history that, well, has, um, or how do, how do I say this? The ship doesn't exactly have much history behind it, but it does hold a significant place within the Polish um, Navy, um, and the, and that um, ship is none other than the um, ORP Orkin G90. Now, um, this um, warship was actually requested to me by a buddy of mine, um, Imperial Imperial Cat. Um, he is a um, viewer of the channel, um, and he actually contacted me over on the Discord server. Um, which is linked down in the description below to actually come and do this um, ship. My, my, um, mind you guys, this video is significantly shorter than most of my other videos due to the fact of there is, well, next to no history on this vessel. Be, even though it holds, well, such a significant spot in Poland. But, um, with that being said, we are going to jump right on into this, but before then, if you guys are interested, um, or if you guys are, um, new to the channel, I welcome you guys in, please do go hit that subscribe button or earn that notification bell, um, and a big, um, thank you to Mighty Machine, who is, um, a longtime viewer of the channel, um, I requested his help on this one. Um, and he did not disappoint the um, video or the um, video footage that you guys are seeing on screen is actually a great credit to him um, due to the fact of he um, actually um, plays the game that um, the that actually had this ship in it so um, a good a good thank you to him now um so the Orkin was an LMN class destroyer. Um, built by the British, um, which was originally named the HMS um, Maidon, or um, Meyer, Meyer Mendon. Um, I'm, I may have pronounced that wrong, and I do apologize. Um, and it was an M-Class Destroyer. So, um, a little background on the M-Class Destroyer destroyers the m class destroyers that were repeats of the preceding l class they displaced um 1935 long tons at standard load and 2750 long tons at deep load the ships had an overall length of 362 feet and three inches a beam of 37 feet and a deep draught of 14 feet they were powered by um, person geared steam turbines, each driving one propeller shaft. Using steam powered by two Admiralty um, three drum boilers, the turbines developed a total um, of 48,000 shaft horsepower and it gave a maximum speed of 36 knots. The ship the ships carried a maximum of five hundred and sixty one long tons of fuel of fuel oil that gave them a range of five thousand five hundred nautical miles at fifteen knots. The ship's complement was one hundred ninety officers and ratings. The M class mounted six 4.7 inch 120 millimeter Mark uh, Mark 11 guns in twin in twin gun mounts, two super firing in front of the bridge and one aft of the superstructure. The aft torpedo tubes were re replaced by a single um, Q and F four inch Mark V anti aircraft gun. Their light anti-aircraft suit was composed of one quadruple mount for two-pounder um, 
um, pom pom guns, two single Orokin 20 millimeter cannons, and two quadruple and two twin mounts for 0.5 inch Vickers Mark III anti aircraft machine guns. Later in the war, single Orokins replaced the .5 caliber machine guns, and still, and still, um, later twin Orokin mounts replaced four of the singles. The M class short the M class ships complete completed with one uh, only one above water quadruple mount for 21 inch um, 533 millimeter torpedoes. But the aft mount was replaced with the 4-inch AA guns removed. The ships were equipped with two depth charge throwers, two racks, and 42 depth charges. Now, the construction of the Oricon, um, she was um, built by the um, Fairfield Shipbuilding and Engineering Company in Govan, Scotland. She was originally commissioned into the Royal Navy as HMS um, Myrand and was founded by St. Helens as the result of the Warship Week National Saving Campaign. Savings Campaign. Now, her service. The Oricon was transferred to the um, Free Polish Navy based in Britain in December of 1942. Oricon served in the Atlantic in early 1943. The destroyer escorted the convoy JW-53 to Russia, resorting, returning with the convoy RA-52, and then operating as convoy escort, escort in the North Atlantic. In July of 1943, she transferred to the body of Polish Supreme um, Chief General um, Wojtkun or, oh, I may butcher this name, I guarantee I'm going to butcher it, um, Walsa, um, Sorky, from Gibraltar to England. At 07 point, uh, 07.05 hours on the 8th of October, 1943, Oregon, under Lieutenant, um, Shachka, um, Helmix, Sir, um, serving as one of the escorts of the convoy SC-143, was hit by a GNAT homing torpedo from the U-boat um, U-378. While escorting the convoy SC-143 SC and sank within minutes, one officer and 43 ratings were rescued by HMS Musketeer. The sinking of the Rorikin was the biggest loss of life in Polish in the of the Polish Navy, resulting from a single incident to, in its entire history. Um, so, um, again, this vessel does hold a significant place in Polish naval history, but uh, again, she doesn't hold that much of a significance. So, um, with that being said, again, I do thank. Imp um, Imperial for the request, and also I do thank the help of Mighty Machine in the making of this video. And with that being said, again, I thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe if you guys haven't already. Hit the like button, um, comment down below if you have any questions, concerns, or requests. And with that being said, um, I thank again, I thank everybody for tuning in, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace out.